most important <laughs> Tyler Chapman makes. Uh, 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 is that a V2 version though, right? It is a V2 version, <laughs> V2 standard Chapman guitar version. V2. Uh, Pro feeling extra mojo. It is. Redesigned pickups on the ground Substantially up. nicer feeling than the old one. Let's <laughs> add to this mix the marvellous energy from Snake Oil Fine Instruments. <laughs> <laughs> so, <clears throat> this, <laughs> this, these are really designed to work together if you want them to, but you don't need to buy both, although I recommend that you do. So this is the amplifier. Imagine it to be some kind of 800 thing. Um, we've got distortion. We've got volume. We've got, <laughs> we've got voice. We've got tone. Voice has a secret extra thing. It's not really secret because I'm going to tell you what it is. It has an extra bit of presence and an extra clipping stage. Mm. So if I back it off... <laughs> and, then, <laughs> and then we've got... The very thing Can for I, great tone. I'm sorry to interrupt your fabulous sales patter, but could you put, I liked the fact that the voice, when the voice and the tone were both at like three o'clock, it was adding like extra stuff in. I was saying a bit more than that. Would you like, like to hear extra? Yeah, I would like. <laughs> Imagine that this is the amplifier, we want to add a dirty stomp box in front of it. Dirty. We go to the very thing you need, the very thing. So here's the amp followed by the stomp. <laughs> Just the very thing on its own, you could achieve a tone like. it's a bizarre video because Rob and I have obviously known about the snake oil thing for a while. But you've never played uh, them. Well no, this Not is really. easy. I kind of, my involvement with this was much more conceptual and just like, wouldn't it be cool if we did this thing like called snake oil? And then Rob really took over and worked with a super cool guy, and I can't remember if we're allowed to say or not. Yeah, we can um, say it. Zach, so from, Zach Mythos. from Mythos. Worked with us very closely. Well, worked with Rob very closely to <laughs> really voice these things. And it's just like, I mean, Rob and I have got such similar tastes in game when we're doing videos and everything. It's like, you know, <laughs> he likes lots, so I like a lot more. No, I mean, as in, I think we both go when it's a good tone. We both go like, yeah, that's the tone, yeah, yeah. that's the tone like that. Yeah, yeah. And they're so nailed on, man. So here is how I have them, how I would have them set. So. Here is just the game. Okay. Uh, and here's my face. <laughs> 
<laughs> I mean, I must admit, I like the Boss Katana. It's the best-selling little amp that we do. But it's a little and, tiny digital. But it's a little katana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and it's, that sounds um, Why don't we revive Peter Honore from his uh, cocaine-filled sure. heroin Pete Honore, super? You're like a drag queen over there. <laughs> <laughs> Danish Pete. Uh, yeah, have a play. Wait, maybe we get something like a bit more... Do you want a different guitar? Uh, yeah, that, use that P90 thing and a bit more laid back for uh, the Danish Pete. Post Pete. Post my I think we might have, I think we might have lost him. <laughs> He's got his Pete. socks out and everything. Pete, Pete. Do, you, do you want to try a different guitar? Please. <laughs> I'm not sure what's happening here, but hopefully Pete's going to play. <laughs> There's lots of grain in there, isn't there? No, I don't. <laughs> That'd still be noisy. <laughs> you won't pick that up, but I'm playing it. No, you won't hear that.